What is up, everyone? It is me, and uh, I'm Nathan, and I am back. And so I just tried to record this video, I know, because it shows the progress right there. And I was just being, it was just terrible. My commentary was off. I was just, I was boring as hell. And, you know, I was playing bad. So I thought I'd just redo this, because why not? Because I don't want to just give you guys a bad video. I, I don't want to be, you know, that was just bad right there. All right. So, yeah, this is Vanilla Dome One, and um, so I'd like to say at this part of the level, it really helps to have a one of those um, what's it called? One of these things because, as you can see, you can just spin through all here. You can just spin through here, and you can get all these compartments open. So that's really helpful. I'm not gonna get that right there. So yeah, there's nothing special around here. I'm not gonna waste my time. Let's just keep moving on. All right. So, yeah, I already got these uh, red blocks. As you can see, you hit them, nothing happens, nothing comes out. That's kind of lame. It, 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 I mean, why why can't they just put a fire flower in there? Why can't they just have a fire flower come out? That that'd be cool. But yeah, um, so I'm not gonna go up there yet because I'm not gonna show all the secret exits to all the secret levels. But yeah, and I'm actually at a pretty bad position at this point because as you can see here, you can get a star, and you're just run, you're destroying all the enemies, and it it kind of it, 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 it hurts to, Because you will do that, and I'm coming here without a wing cap now because that will happen. Now there is one of the I know I already got all the uh, all of the uh, dinosaur coins, but there was one right there um, at, at the very end of that thing that you can get. So yeah, I'm sorry. All right, so let's just go up here, and now another dinosaur coin that is pretty. It's it's fairly hard to get. I'm not going to get that. I'm not going to do that. It's right up here. Um, it's So you just go here, you go in between here, dinosaur coins right up here. Now, if you're big and you don't want to be getting small, you could just do this the whole time. That is complete, that's tedious. It takes forever. Don't do that. Just, just get, just be a man, get small, and do that. Get short, get shorty, and do that. So there's another dinosaur coin up here. I know I can't show that, but... You know, um, the other ones that I, I think I missed a couple, uh, a couple, um, they're, they're pretty straightforward, so you should have no trouble finding them. Final dinosaur coin, right here. Yeah. Alright. So, luckily I didn't get all the other dinosaur coins in the other level, I mean the next level, so, you know, we don't have to have any trouble with that. So, yeah. Alright. Let's do that. Alright, now for Vanilla Dome 2. Now, first, I'm just going to show you how to get to the, uh, what's it called? To the Switch Palace, and then I'm just going to go onto, uh, my different account on this game, and I'm going to show you the Switch Palace level, just because I don't wanna, I don't wanna skip that. You know what, actually, I already recorded it on here, so I could just show you the footage of that Switch Palace. Yeah, <laughs> I just do that. Let's be smart. So, yeah. All right. So, first dinosaur coin right here. It really helps to have a fire flower in these uh, in these levels because um, you know you can shoot cheap cheeps. And also, if you have a shell or anything, when you swim, it's a lot easier because instead of tapping constantly, all you, all you have to do is you just have to um. You just have to hold the shell and you just move on the control pad, but you have to be holding B, of course. Um, but yeah, so it, it's a lot easier when you have a shell, um, to swim. So yeah, don't hit that before you go back there. Remember, do that. 
hit that then, and then go down here. And now there's another dinosaur coin down here. And um, I guess what you would do is you would just wait for one of the... I, I, I guess if you wanted to get all the dinosaur coins in one try, um, you just have to use that red little block right there. And you'd have to wait for some of the... Um, what are they called? Some of the coins to harden back into blocks. You'd have to jump up on those hardened coins into blocks, and then you're done. So yeah. So right now I'm just gonna be showing you this level right here. So in here you gotta. I'm just going to show how you. Um, you can get a one up in every P switch palace thing. Um, oftentimes you can get more than one life. Uh, I'm trying to, it's fine. You know, let's just go for it. Oftentimes you get more than one life um, in here. All you have to do is hit that P-switch, have this thing come around here, and destroy all the things, and I could just kill that, and I guess... Oh, that was cool. Well, now let's trick this out. Yes. Yes. All right, so those red blocks you saw on the past level, they will turn to red, but I'm not going to go back there yet because, I'm, as I said, I'm going to do that in a later level. Now we can go back to world 3-2, and we can go... Do the level the right way here and now we are at vanilla dome too now we're just gonna finish this up so i'm just going to go ahead and destroy that cheap cheap because if a cheap cheap is bouncing around over the water you can kill it just because so i'm just gonna get this so i don't lose it um and yeah so i'm just gonna shoot that cheap cheap right there like this we're gonna get the vine can we, can we please? Right. So. <sighs> yeah. Alright, so. Alright, so I'm just going to demonstrate that thing I just told you about right here. So as you can see, we're, and I lost it. Well, that sucks, but you know what? I'll live, I'll live. It's, it's fine. It's just freaking perfect. It's, it's, it's alright. Alright, can we, you know what? Screw that. I'm just going to finish this level. Okay, so we're gonna just get this right here. Go up here. Yeah. Alright, so remember, this did not do anything with this. That's bad. Idea. Okay. So, alright, so I guess what you wanna do right here is you just want to. Uh, you probably don't wanna leave that much. You probably. Oh! I know what you do. Duh. That was stupid. Of course, the, the spring down here. I can't believe I didn't think of that. I can't believe I didn't see that. Yeah, you get the spring up here. You put you, you put the spring onto here. And it's going to push me off because it's a little jerk. It's a little green jerk. And I I love that. That's... Okay, okay. We're good. It's, 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 up. it's fine. No problem. So, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So today... It's a Monday. I mean, I I hope you're having a pretty good Monday. I mean, I know it's Monday, and it's kind of impossible to be happy on Mon- Oh my god. Can we get it? Can we just- It's pretty impossible to be happy on Monday, but, you know, just, just try. You can at least try to be happy. For me. Alright. So, yeah, I had a pretty good day yesterday. I watched Ghostbusters, and I don't think I've watched that, like- I might have watched it when I was younger or something, and I, I, I don't remember it, but it, it's good. It's funny. I don't know why I'd point that out. I, I mean, I watched Ghostbusters yesterday. I mean, I mean, you all know it's Ghostbusters. I mean, it, everyone's seen Ghostbusters, right? I mean, seriously. Yeah, just go to your hair. <sighs> all right, we're doing pretty good now. I'm just now noticing, you 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 really know you're you're kind of running out of things to talk about when you just start talking about your day, you know, during a let's play. I mean, just all right. So you can just spin jump over these ghosts and like when jumping on something with Yoshi, um, like with Yoshi, when you spin jump on something like a ghost, you won't be hurt. So that is really helpful. I really like the spin jump. Plus, it looks awesome when you spin jump. You just look at this. And Mario fires fireballs. And yeah, let's get that. Look at that. Look at that. Tricking this out right here. So we can hit this right there. Get that vine to go up there. Let's do this. Okay. 
Whoa! Oh, it didn't con- that was- that was a bit too early. Alright. Just go down here. That's kind of funny. He drops you right on that. Alright, just get that. Yeah, that might be kind of tricky. You just have to wait for that the uh, the ring of booze, the little gap in there to come around. But so, look out for these things. Do not jump directly on them. If you jump on them, you will die. I mean, if you touch them in any other way than spin jumping on them, you will freaking die. Uh, sometimes I like to be crazy and I just like to just run through this part, just like spin jump and just like run through it like nobody's business and just just be a complete boss a complete badass but you know i'm not feeling lucky today so you are not gonna want to get rid of these coins if you go to that door i think it'll just take you back to like the beginning or near the beginning or something so you don't want to do that so that is how you do that that's how you beat that level okay <sighs> course clear all right now let's go on that thing Vanilla Dome 3. Let's save and continue. And I should probably stop saving because if I mess something up and want to redo the episode of the Let's Play, then I can't really because I already beat all the levels and that kind of sucks. So, yeah. I mean, I guess I could restart the game, but that wouldn't be very smart. But, yeah. Alright, so let's get this Buzzy Beetle right here. Let's shoot him up there. Get that mushroom. Get that mushroom. Go down, slide down there, get that. If you know, if you don't know, if you go on top of a hill and you press down, you can slide down. And that's, that's pretty much it. And if there's enemies at the bottom, your butt will destroy the enemies. And that's, that's, that's about it. I mean, there's nothing special to it. So, let's go up here. There's a hidden little block right there. And here you can get one of these guys. I forgot. Great. Now, it is somewhere in this level where you can go and you can fly up. And, yeah, it's right here. And you can get a... Oh, wait, it's just a, uh, it's just one of those pipes that leads. Oh, it's over there. You can go get a three-up moon, I think. Oh, that sucks. I missed it. Oh, that's too bad. I missed it, but you know what? Whatever. Um, well, it's not the end of the world. All right. I already have 50 lives. I don't think I'm needing any more. So, yeah. You can't go up any of these guys right here. Let's just... Jump on this thing to get it started. Come over here. Um, yeah. Funny thing is, if you have a Yoshi and there's a Piranha Plant coming in and out of a pipe, if it's still in the pipe and you use Yoshi and you use your tongue um, on the pipe, it'll actually like s somehow stick through the pipe and eat the Piranha Plant. And so that's helpful, I guess, if you don't want to wait for the things to come out. Yeah. Alright, get that. And I'm still carrying it. That's... I did not mean to do that. Whoa. Alright, so right here, um... You want to be pretty careful. Fling this thing up, and... Can we... Can we hit this? Get that. You can get Yoshi right there. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. 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 Oh. Alright. Be careful here. If... If Yoshi falls down there, I don't think you can get... Oh, you can get back up. I, I, I remember not being able to get back up after falling down there with Yoshi. Um, I mean, like, without dismounting Yoshi, if that's a word. But, you know what? I guess you can. You just gotta bounce other things. So, we got these things. These are called blargs, I guess, because they're like... And they're, th they're things, so... Watch that thing down there. You gotta time your jump right. Um, I think if you jump at the wrong time, I mean, if, like, the screen will go up and then that thing under you will disappear and there, you're gonna have nothing to jump onto and that will suck. So you just gotta have to sit there. Last dragon coin right here and we have a nice feather. Come here, Yoshi. Alright. Well, let's just get all these guys. As you can see, like I said earlier, you can do this and you can do this. And I believe right here there's something you can... Yeah, there's there's something back here. Um, so right here, if you run and you go and fly, there are these clapper things up here. And you cannot step on these with Mario. You can step on these with Yoshi, though. And here's another dragon coin. There are not always six dragon coins at the level. That's just special. Now, um, here you can just let yourself on the top of the flagpole. Um, let's see how good... 28 stars, so we're gonna have to do one of those 
one of those um, mini game things that I really was not in the mood for. But you know what? I'm I'm never in the mood for these things. Let's just see if we can try to get something decent. All right, just go and just hit these things. I mean, it's annoying sometimes because sometimes they just won't let you hit them. And right, nothing. That was a dud. That sucks. But you know what? If I had a dollar for every time I said, but, you know, there are a lot of things. I know I say this a lot, too, but if, if, there are a lot of things that I say over and over again in my Let's Play videos and stuff. I guess not a Let's Play, it's more of a walkthrough, because that's what I have in the title, but, you know, whatever. So, yeah, this level there, bullet bill shooting, sh shooting at you from every direction, I mean, everywhere, but you, you, you think this... Oh, that was lucky. You think this part's bad? Ooh. Ooh, you got it in for you, buddy. Yeah. Yeah. Just wait till you get past the checkpoint. So, yeah. Hint, hint. Past the checkpoint, it's pretty hard. Actually, it's it's not that hard. When I was younger, when I was like seven years old, I probably thought it was the hardest freaking thing. But now I am I'm a, I'm a master at the Mario's, so... Yeah, I guess we're not gonna see that. So yeah. So go in here. You can ride on here. This is necessary to get another one of your uh, dragon coins. So just ride on here. Jump over these things. Jump over these. We're gonna get some coins on the way, so that helps. We're nowhere near to a hundred though, so that's you know we're not gonna get a one up. Just duck here, or if you're small, don't duck. Just go over here and. Got a dragon coin. I was kind of doubting myself for that. I was like, is there really a dragon coin in here? I'm like, am I going to be wrong? There was. I was right once again. I always am. Not really. Yeah. All right. Finished that level. Now we are on to the castle. Yeah. I'm not really looking forward to this. This, this level used to give me hell. So, do not spin here, because as you can see, there are more of these things below you, and you will just die, and that is it. So, oh, that could have been, ended up badly, but it didn't. As you can see, there are these magic hoops. Whenever they fire something at a, um, at one of these bricks, they make them, they make them turn into something else, so that's nice. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Alright, watch out for that right there. Now, you're going to need this if you want to do something, um, exploit a little shortcut here. All right, weird. It's not very good. This part is kind of hard. Um, all right, we got it. We got it. Just go up into this door right here. It's a lot easier if you have a wing cap thing. A feather. I don't know why I keep calling. I'm thinking of Mario 64. I don't know why though. So, darn it. Luckily, we got a checkpoint. So, thanks pop up thing. And no, I do not want to make the following changes to my computer. Well, you know what? It's okay. We haven't gotten any dragon coins yet. This is gonna be just fine. All right. So you gotta be careful here. There's all these things. They're gonna crush you if you're not, if you're not, if you don't go slowly. So you kind of want to take your time ar around here, um, or else it could end up pretty bad. So yeah. Also, you don't want to go too slow because there's lava below you, and you don't want to get burnt by the lava. I mean, so yeah. I'm messing with the L button. Do not do that. It's just it's it's not worth it okay i'm just gonna wait up here no item up here great yeah we gotta wait for this to go down and there's a little sliver of land where you can stand on you can go up here watch out for this guy all right so uh some of the uh, dragon coins in this part in this level are actually hard to get and i believe they're all in, they are all in here so it might be kind of difficult for you. I don't know. It's kind of difficult for me sometimes. There's that thing come out there. Look out for that thing. Right here you can get a free one of these. Okay. Luckily I'm not going to get crushed. But I could have gone through a bit faster if I would have been able to get up there. So. Just go on this top one right here. And uh, you might want to be pretty quick on here. you got to be watching your game. you got to keep going down here. The fourth dragon coin... And whew, that was kind of close. 
close. I thought it was going to fall into the lava. Alright. Spin these two guys right here. And we got more. This is just the same thing for like a couple screens. And now this is this is the tricky one. So what you want to do here is you want to go in here, jump around there, and you gotta you gotta do that pretty freaking quick, or else you will die. And now we have made it to Lemmy Cuba. So yeah. come here, come here, little bastard. Sorry. All right, let's get him. So he's got two little decoys, and you know this is not supposed to be that hard. Actually, it is the boss. So. I guess it is kind of supposed to be that hard. It usually does not take me this long. It hasn't taken me this long to beat this since I was seven years old. Since the first time I played this game. And no, I'm not seven years old now. I'm 14 for your information. That was just... <sighs> well, that was World 3. Or at least minus the secret levels. Which we will be getting later on. So, yeah, I remember the first time I beat this level, I freaking, I, I, I flipped out. I was like, I was screaming, I was watching Mario tear down the castle, I was like, ah! I used to do that every time I beat one of the worlds that I found hard. I think it was like this world, and then world six, and then world seven, the last world, which I found really hard. And I was, I mean, I used to get so happy. It was, yeah. so we're going to save and continue. Next time, we are going to take on World 4, which only has, like, literally three levels. That is Butter Bridge. I'll see you then. Yeah, it's, it's Butter Bridge, and then it's, like, two levels that aren't even on the bridge. So, it's Butter Bridge, and then... Thanks. See you next time!